what's going on ladies and gentlemen and welcome back to the channel i'm back at it again over here on twitter and i found something very very important that i wanted to share with you guys so here goes the scoop um the game known as rebirth champions i believe is officially closed as of today so as you guys can see, um, this uh, user right here, who happens to actually be a YouTuber with 6.5k subscribers, um, they tweeted this and they asked for retweets and everything like that so they can try to, you know, generate a, I guess, like a, you know, like a general discussion here and everything like that, basically. But anybody that has been playing this game, if you have been experiencing issues and everything like that, um, comment on this video. I want to know what those issues were because a lot of Roblox games on the platform, generally these um, developers and these, you know, scripters and builders and everything like that, whenever there is a situation going on in a game, a lot of these guys tend to fix the problem before it actually becomes a issue where players have to report the game. And that's exactly what happened with Rebirth Champions. So, if you guys look at the, um, this, like, message that was sent to him, it says this account has been closed due to a violation of ter terms of service here do not create games intended to scam other players so people in the comment section over here for twitter people were commenting that there was a issue with like certain game passes so when it comes down to a game ladies and gentlemen game passes obviously cost robux and if you purchase something and you're not given something that you purchase that is in a way a sort of scam you know because you're scamming that person out of their robux they paid for it and you didn't give them something in return or the thing that they purchased did not work properly so it ended up being a waste of their robux and you're going to receive that robux they're not going to be able to refund that robux back to the player you know a lot of times when we do spend robux in the game we are thinking oh man i shouldn't spend those robux i wish i can get it back but there is no way that you guys can get back your robux on games that you you know game passes that you purchase and everything like that so i believe that that could have been the situation someone mentioned it over here um this cool kid person over here says i think someone reported it because there's a bug with the equipped game pass and since it didn't give him or her their pet slots after purchase they reported it for scamming and rip everyone's robux so right there i agree and then you have another person it's miggy replies over here i bought the auto clicker game pass and it doesn't work so Pretty much Roblox, they said, you know what, we're not going to allow this to stay open. So for anybody that was playing this game right now, you're probably looking for it. I believe I played this a couple times here. I just didn't make any videos, but I believe I played it. And I believe Snug Life played this game as well. Um, but if you are looking for it now, it is officially closed. It's no longer open. Um, the person that is tweeting about this I don't think they are banned or anything like that I think the game is just closed for now um, I don't see anything mentioning about his Roblox account being banned um, this pulse person writes did they give you any warnings or something before deleting your account let's see if we could uh, Sorry to hear this, man, but I did have a bug where my auto clicker game pass didn't work after I bought it. Alright. Let's see. It's probably the clicking part, but I don't know. Very confusing. Game pass bugs is the only reason. Okay. So, yeah, to like really sum up this video, ladies and gentlemen, um, this game. It has been taken down because of faulty game passes not delivering on what they were supposed to deliver on. 
but this person is you know playing the I don't know card basically saying that they don't know what's going on why is this happening and everything like that obviously once again going through what I already said if your game passes don't work and you have players purchasing them using their robux your game is taking the robux from those players and not delivering out so that is a way of a scam you know you're persuading this person to purchase your product and then your product is not working you're taking the money but you're not able to refund the person because the product is not working all you're gonna say is oh we'll close down the game to refix it and then these players join a week later and they still experience the same thing they complain they complain they complain and if they ask for their robux back it's gonna be a situation where you're gonna say well I can't give you your robux back and then boom there goes your report this person scammed me out of my robux I really want my robux back and then it becomes a issue with Roblox and Roblox does not want recurring issues they decide they're gonna put their foot down they're gonna close your game so if you are a developer watching this video make sure you are fixing everything before you update and release your games ladies and gentlemen because so help me God a lot of games that are really really good on the platform are being closed down and removed you have games that are you know being held for copyright claims and everything like that people are stealing maps and stuff you know copying it is it's it's gone out of hand pretty much basically at this point it's just like you know people just gotta take their time a lot of people are in a rush to just release something and not fully you know analyze what they're putting out there a lot of people are just you know really in a rush to make some robux off of game passes you guys gotta think before you do if you guys enjoyed this video please drop a like and if you're brand new to the channel watching for the very first time please hit that subscriber button and also hit that share button as well because this person wants a whole bunch of retweets so there could be a general discussion and hopefully Roblox will see how many people is retweeting and reacting to this and then maybe just maybe they can look further into you know the investigation and possibly try to open the game back up for the public. I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace!